Well, happy Saturday. I'm Storm Team Forecaster Jesse Rick. A little bit less humidity today, a little bit less as far as the mercury goes as well. 76 degrees, but relatively seasonable. And when you're out in the sunshine, it'll feel pretty nice today. We are keeping things mostly sunny today. A few clouds in the middle of the sky in the middle of the day. Really wouldn't keep it dry though. And last 30 days have been incredibly dry as well. Only about an inch and a quarter, not even that. So about two and a half inches below normal as far as rain goes. We are going to add some rain to the forecast tomorrow. Today, though, high pressure keeps us dry, keeps the wind light. A little bit of light easterly wind sets up by the end of the day. That'll keep things cooler right at the lakefront. For tonight, cloud cover start to increase a little bit. And as we head into your Sunday, I think future forecasts really overdoing the precip. This will just come in the form of clouds increasing from the west to the east. And throughout the day, chances for rain will increase from the west to the east. I think the best chance to see some showers and a couple thunderstorms really comes, really ramps up as far as Sunday night's concerned as this warm front is just kind of hanging around south eastern Wisconsin. Many of us could get a quarter of an inch to about a half an inch overnight Sunday night and into Monday. I think a few scattered showers are still possible on Monday morning and into the afternoon hours. They're going to start to taper off. We're looking at a very long dry stretch of weather after this storm system moves through. So hopefully you get a nice watering for your lawn and for the gardens as well tomorrow and tomorrow night. Today though, enjoy the sunshine, enjoy the dry, cooler and comfortable air. 73 today in Sheboygan, 76 in Milwaukee, 75 in Waukesha with mostly sunny skies tonight partly cloudy to mainly clear 58 at the lakefront 56 degrees in Waukesha may be able to see a few of the shooting stars the Perseus meteor showers going on that really ramps up those Sunday night unfortunately as that storm system pushes on in that's going to increase the cloud cover especially Sunday night when it's supposed to peak 76 though on Sunday again cloud cover will be increasing there will be several dry hours throughout the day on Sunday especially during the morning then that storm system moves on in we'll be looking at rain chances Sunday night and into Monday so that's why we're looking at poor viewing conditions for the meteor shower just something to be aware of, but that will be peaking Sunday night and into Monday. Might be able to catch a few of those tonight as it starts to ramp up. After that storm system moves through, though, the jet stream has a bit of a dip, so we'll stay cooler than average. This jet, though, since it is to our south, it's going to keep all the rain to the south as well. So our dry stretch is going to start on Tuesday and continue all the way through next week. Just temps are going to stay cooler than average, which is, yes, something we've gotten used to this summer.